Hi, my name is Dr. Pecoraro. I'm a chiropractor in Westfield, New Jersey. Today I wanted to speak about what's the best way to get into and out of a car if you have a bad back. And I'm going to be speaking as though you'd be getting in and out of the driver's seat. Now the first thing you want to do is to have the seat back as far as you can. Now if you have to lean in to do this, don't do it because that will be hard on your back. But when you see what I'm telling you, you can leave the car, the seat that way. When you get out, it'll be ready for when you get back in again. Same thing with the steering wheel. You want to move the steering wheel to the side as far as it will go towards the door. And this, you have to, if you have to lean in, to do this, don't do that, but if you can do it the time before when you get out of the car, and so it's already that way when you approach the car, then you should do that. So what this does is it leaves a large gap between the steering wheel and the uh, seat of the car for you to fit in. When you approach the car, get up to the car and stand with your back towards the seat, towards the car facing straight away. Use your arms to sit straight back onto the seat. You could use your arms against the sides of the car, the door, whatever. Because you don't want to bounce into the seat because that will probably hurt. You want to ease yourself down gently. Now once you're in the seat, you take one leg and put it in the car as you turn and then bring the other leg into the car as you turn. Once you're in the car you can move the seat up and put the steering wheel where it's supposed to be. And then you can do whatever you need to do to drive. When you get out of the car you're doing all these things in reverse. First you move the steering wheel off to the side as far as you can then the seat back as far as you can and with the door open you first bring one foot out turn a little bit bring the other foot out turn a little bit so you're facing straight away from the car and then you use your arms on the door and on the side of the car to help lift you straight up out of the car so i hope this information has been helpful to you and I'll try to bring you more information at a later date.